We actually got it from my grandfather. I thought they would like it, you know, bring it in and let them look at it and everything, so. Hi, Chamley, how you doing? I'm doing great. Good. How about yourself? I'm doing fine, thank you. Well, I see you got a sombrero, but tell me a little bit about it. I came across this a few years ago. It's probably circa 1930s to 50s. Okay. It's a Stetson sombrero. Oh, okay. Um, Stetson is known for making the cowboy hat a part of Americana history. Sombreros are a part of Mexican culture. So um, kind of the same thing going. The brim is made to protect you from the sun, but something like this, you would probably be more of a dress-up hat or maybe even see at a rodeo or definitely in a parade. It's very unique. I've never heard of Stetson making a sombrero, and it's got the logo right there. What size is it here? Uh, you're say? welcome to try to put it on. You don't mind? No, go ahead. All as long right. as your hair isn't greasy. Sombreros are yeah, a yeah. festive hat, yeah. and you know what's a great part of a festa? The siesta after. There you go. This makes me feel like I should take a nap. <laughs> it yeah. sits right on Good. top of my head, yes. too. I don't have the smallest head myself. Uh, neither do I. <laughs> Where did you get it? And I ran across it from a dealer friend of mine, and uh, he knew I liked Texas stuff. So we did some horse trading, and this is what I walked away with. How much are you looking to get for? I want, uh, based on the condition and uh, just the uniqueness, I want $3,800. OK, um, I would like to buy it, but I think a safe price for me would probably be, I'm thinking maybe like $1,500. The best I would do on that is probably $3,500. $3,500, yeah. I mean, it's a beautiful hat. I just think at $3,500, it just doesn't leave me any room at all to make it. Totally understand. It's okay. really cool, though. Thanks for bringing it okay. in. OK. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. OK.